last episode we fixed the atmosphere, atmospheric pressure. However, it caused these guys in the atmosphere to spring a leak. So let's escape. Let's go. Right, let's get her out of there. Oh, she can't, she can't, why can she not get out? Is she afraid of water? Maybe she is. Right, let's see if we can get her out with him. I could try and break the glass. Broken Go on, glass then. is dangerous, Mac. Thank you, Moses. Right, give me this. Oh, you don't even need the screwdriver. Ah, damn it. The control box is shorted. You'll have to bridge the short. Easy. The handle won't stay down. The door won't stay open. What are we... You get through the door. But... I'll figure it out. Get through it. Go! So now it's weird why she wouldn't leave the first time. Right, where are we headed? Through this door. Come on, baby. Workshop. Mag? Moses? He's completely cut off. Mac. Can you hear me? God damn it. Oh, more dead guys. The wretched remains of a dr diving suit and its occupant. Vital fluids have long since bled out from the rendered torso. An igniter. I don't know what to do. Oh, we don't have access to these guys. Okay. Maps. Half a dozen suspended maps, each depicting major coastlines around the world. Curiously, half of the maps seem to detail ancient land masses of eons past. Charles, are you there? Read me. Mac, are you there? Yeah. Oh, thank God. <sighs> yeah, don't get too excited. Still flooding in here. Running out of headspace, fast. Okay, uh, we'll figure it out. Yeah, figure it out. Come on, let's figure it out. Oh, we can't. I'm not even... I can't go back to her. Access portal. Nothing. Well, this is the reverse of the... the symbol we used at the end of last episode. Pressure management. Ah, uh, okay. Boom, boom, boom. Nice. Oh, I see. For oh, this is gonna be hard. So. SpaceX, 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 SpaceX. SpaceX, Space X. You can't do that. Space X space. Oh shit. 
Right. Unless this is... First, second, third. So let me try it here. SpaceX, 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 X, Space. Right, okay. So give us the middle one. The top one has only got one. You can't only have one on that one. That's... That's not a potential because that has to be empty. Right, wait there. That's potential. So let's try the top one. We need one in there. Actually, we can brute force this. We don't even need to do this cleverly. Right, so all we need is one in there. Got it. Boom. Yeah. Brute force. We knew that I had to have one there. The middle one was done. Let's do it. What happened? I don't actually know what we've done. Maintenance requested. Moses. Hello, Mac. Your situation does not seem fun. Not at all. You're not wrong. Can you open this vent? I hit the maintenance request. My Mac. Right, let's get with the bare necessities here. Wait, what do we need to do with this guy? We can't be her. We can get out with him. Oh no. Igniter. Shit, I don't I don't actually know what I'm doing. Uh Lads, no. We definitely have to be the bear because I can't. Oh no, there we go. Maintenance hatch. Maybe we have to find the hatch with the bear? No, no, I don't want to examine that. I don't need that. Hmm. I don't know, son. Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Can we break this down? Maybe that does something. I am so Dumped. I 
I don't really want to touch that because that's currently fixed. Oh, the atmosphere computer. Do we have to play with this? Open maintenance vents. Maintenance is important. Done. That's not open. Unless that opened it for him. There we go, it's open for him. Get in. In there like swimwear. Not bad, Bear. Mac, I am glad you are not dead. More than just a toy, isn't he? You may have a point. Where are you? I think uh, an escape pod bay. Looks sealed though, give me a second here. Another sealed door. A secure lock in iris leads to the water overflow chamber below. It's controlled elsewhere. Yeah, it's the escape pods. And big shock, they're all gone. At least someone got out of here alive. Yeah, but that's bad for us. Wait. Pods aren't all gone. And not everyone escaped. What do you mean? Someone's alive? In one of the pods. Yes. They're not moving, but... I can hear them. Inside. Hello? Can you hear me? Are you hurt? This guy's hand, he's, he's holding something. Right, wing nut, take that off. Not gonna be easy. Lock will be pressurized. If you can hear me, I'm gonna try and get you out of there. Just stay calm. He's got something. I don't... What could we use on there? To depressurize it. That's the only piece of equipment we've got. We can be her now, so what can she do? Ah, there we go. It stopped us being her, but now we can play with this. Images. I imagine these are going to be hideous. A mule. Diver. I don't know if that's a, a pipeline or a bomb. Personal log. Matt Barton. Bio days maintenance. Happy birthday to me. I'm 90 years old and I don't look a day over 45. It's one of the perks of a pampered life as an organ insurance product. Lifeblood Corp at your surface. To celebrate I ordered a Kazu Marzu and washed it down with a Kananao. The Sard... Denga, live maggots and all. I've always been a loner with a penchant. Penchant for the good life, even during my time at La Vida Paradise, which only cost me a kidney. Now my family debt has finally been paid off and the best is yet to come. Have you had any more run-ins with the scrubbers? When I'd go out for pressure tests a few months back, I'd see a swarm every two or three outings. Now I see one every time I leave the mule. I know they're supposed to be harmless, but I get the impression they're not working correctly. The drive, the dive suits I'm servicing Show up with electrical burns and the deep sea rated metallic glass reinforced. I've almost overhauled the Max Ocean M4 diving suit, but several parts still need to be replaced and repaired. Unfortunately, the old components are unsalvageable because they were melted by scrubbers. I wish we had one of those fancy matter replicators Patelgo is always talking about. And it's not just these duplicator trash buckets. 
I heard the temple jockeys got one. What a waste. I would print a Yubari melon with the sliced fugu and sashimi for breakfast, lunch and dinner. I've been combing through the old maintenance logs and found a restricted entry referencing Alpha, the first forward operating base. It was decommissioned about a decade, decade ago, well before my time. Apparently, it's not just some weird artifacts on the ocean bed. There is a Newman down there. Number three, Cairn decided to leave it trapped at the bottom of the ocean. I find it hard to believe that they would abandon a Newman, but here it is in green pixels. Imagine the value of a Newman, dead or alive. Consider my 90 year old youthful interest peaked. If I can navigate a sample collector over the plateau, maybe we can explore the old base. I'll have to rope in Follis to get this sneak and peek. He has access to off the books equipment that won't get me shot or quarantined or both. Congratulations on your winning streak last night. I heard you cleaned Matthews out, buzzed her sample collector like a hornet with the roid rage. Listen up salt dog, I need to borrow one of your UAVs for a couple of hours. It's the least you can do after forgetting my birthday. Sometimes I think about my rich, sorry, about the rich prick who got my left kidney. Of all my organs, it was my favourite. I've always found it funny that some wealthy people want real organs when we can grow, even print, perfectly good replicas. They call themselves 100% human. What a bunch of yellow leaf fantasists. But who am I then? I felt like a cow or a broodmare at times, but the pay is too good. Besides, after being genetically paired with a policyholder, you have to emulate their lifestyle to minimise the chance of rejection. Tonight I draw my sorrows in manuka honey drizzled in garlicly alba white truffles. At least I still have my heart. Heart replicas just aren't the same. They keep ticking even when you're a corpse. The rover excursion to Alpha Base was a bust. A cave-in prevented traditional access, so I squeezed through a fissure, passing some old equipment. Once I was out of the cave and heading for the base entrance, what could only be described as a bloated slug with teeth, with teeth tore the drone to pieces like a hungry man would a suits vid butter poached lobster. I ran this operation in the black. Follis is going to go black ballistic on my ass. Hey, the scrubbers that maintain the graphene hull of the domes A through E seem to be multiplying. I know they are by engineered not to breed, but I am certain there are more of them every day. A scrubber orgy would be a thing to behold. I know some crew are fond of the blue electric lights show they put on, but I suspect these critters are dangerous. I request an immediate catch and catalog of the swarm. Kane Saki, the mule is in chaos. A vet was hit by a stray bullet, which completely tore off part of her head, and Bernie's ribs were knocked in. I saw a rover at Bulwark during my sneak and peek. It may come in handy. We stopped the base kill order, Follow simulated the VAT, then Killed the hard line between the mule and DS-15, I cut the data tether to deep sea simultaneously and he nuked the uplink. I don't know how long the ruse will last, hopefully long enough to get us topside. We are heading back to the mule now. I would die for a dollop of Almas caviar on a salt teen cracker. The bell returned as scheduled but headed Oceanside after only 10 minutes. I hope some of the crew escaped. The bell requires at least one occupant to ascend and sure as shit wasn't us in there. I mostly made it back. Robert the Scrubbers melted his suit. Al dente. I almost knocked on dive re-entry trying to get away from them, but those electro squibs caused a power surge on the moon pool's iris door. Alas, there is no rescue. I smell the ghastly aromatic stench of rotten onions like a putrid lobster beast. Welcoming of a Newman to the Collective. We are pleased to announce the birth of a Newman, placed in STEM on this very day, Jebediah the first of his name. And it came to pass that the Nexus was plagued by the presence of one of the nine who showed contempt for the rules and brought discord to the network with its injudicious conduct. But the church is also merciful and did offer Newman a chance to repent and reform its ways, so let this be a warning to all who dare defy the will of Cain. The consequences of disrespect and disobedience are severe, and none shall escape the fiery wrath of judgment, but fear not. For even in the darkest of times, Cain's light shines bright, and those who follow the path of righteousness shall be rewarded with a place in the Nexus, where they may thrive and reach their full potential, far from the reach of fiery abysms. May the light of Cain shine upon us all. Okay. Established Crew 9, decommissioned, early exploration, research. Oh, 
Oh, look at this bad boy. I don't know what a Newman is, by the way. I don't know if anybody else knows what a Newman is. Well, there's that shark. The big boy. I wonder if it's a fish. Incorporation. Right, we've explored everything in there. We didn't get much information. <sighs> Found a suit. Rear thruster looks damaged. Well, we can fix that. Take that off. Right, okay. Oh, I'm According certified. to who? Oh yeah, baby. Right, L give this to him. He can break that down, and then we can reassemble it with the good part. Rust got into this igniter. Twisting it just right got the thruster working. Excellent. We combine it with a good igniter. Good thing these thrusters are modular. Shazam. Just put in a new igniter and there we are. He's a piss. Alright. Since thrust is replaced. Since thrust is operating within established parameters. Cave systems. Biotechnological deep atmosphere environment suit. Systems check. Warning. Suit maintenance required before operation. Lungs are damaged or missing. The heating system is damaged or missing. And that's changing the pressure calibration. Okay. Uses bio lungs. Yeah. Looks like um, biofix mark three or four. They're damaged though, and I think my only way out of here is fixing this thing. You want to take a bio dais out onto the seafloor? How hard could it be? This woman. Right. That's gonna be the heating system. I wonder if he can dismantle that as well. You can system in lungs. Right, that's fair enough. That definitely works. What do we need to go in there? Oh, I've pinched the lungs. Careful with those. Carry disease just like any other organ. I know how biotech works, Mac. And he split these apart. I want to try and break this. No, can't. No. Okay. What? Field escape capsule. I don't imagine we use that on there. What about bio lungs? No. Thought so. Right. Um. We haven't finished exploring with her, so let's continue. This guy. Charlie, what the hell? Uh, it's um, a dive suit, looks like. Cut in half. Yeah, so is the person inside it. Where the hell are you? Looks like a dive suit bay. Oh God, there's another body here. Gonna keep looking. Maybe there's a way out or, or a way to help you. Don't know why we can't press that. Hmm. 
Right, I... I'm slightly lost. We need something sharp. Because we there's still something to get in the events that the bear was in. An arm. Can we deep fry this? Now, definitely can't use any any of these items. Uh, it's a bit of a stretch, but now nah, I didn't think you could combine them. Fair enough. Okay, that's back into the helmet, which we don't need to be here. Right, let's leave. Let's try him. He can't get in there. Is there anywhere else he can go? No. This guy's actually trapped in here for good. Right, maybe the bear. Local vents have been unlocked. I would like to know how to get through this. Ah, there we go. It's unlocked. Happy days. I think one of my only criticisms with the game so far is that at times you'll activate something and it will switch you automatically to another character to see what it's done but that sometimes takes my train of thought away from me because when we were the bay and we unlocked that console for the guy i would I, I was about to go and walk to this vent but then because it switched away to the other character i forgot i was about to do that if that makes sense this is just... not a good place to play. It smells wrong. Like dead things. Ever wonder what the point was of putting olfactory sensors on a toy? Maybe because it makes him more real. You are either real or you're not. You're right, Mose. I'm sorry. Yeah, so what I was going to say there. Yeah, so what I need to do is I need to be more like switched on memory wise so that we don't forget certain things are in certain places right stasis pod controls let me have a look at this we're gonna get some bio lungs from these guys i know it hello i am moses volunteer pods what were they doing here you know the answer to that if they were here by their own accord they were paying off debts to kane if Defritas male, blood zero minus, sex male, age intubation eight, days in stasis 833. These are in pain. Just shut it down. Alright, well we've, we've ended that guy's life. Oh, beautiful. So that is all kinds of... Ah. 7154. Why is the head moving? 7154. Dockmate system active. Program procedure. Hysterectomy. Mastectomy. Lung. Ah, we're going to have to find out.
Did they say it was a nanotech? Nanotech rings a bell. Right, well, we, we can't do anything with this at the minute. We don't know what we're doing. Right, I'm not going to shut that down. We might need these. Hold on, before we go any further. So many places to go. 7154, let me remember that. We're probably going to need it. 7154. Charlie, Hope's favourite. Favourite what? A shark. Hope's favorite animal. It is lovely. Oh, this bad boy, yeah. You are in Aquarium H1. Hope's favorite. Cold. It no longer breathes. That harpoon. Be careful, bear. It's explosive tipped. My Mac. Yeah, there's some fucked up shit inside this shark. Frozen coil. Ah, I know what to do with this. I know what to do, son. Wanna light it up. Heated coil. Hope's favorite is alive. Oh, good God. Hope's favorite is alive. Mouse, get away from that. Look at its eyes. Explosive tip top boom, we've got heavy artillery. Oh, that was cool. Right. Tidious, we've heard about this guy in somebody else's log. Bassa Grand. Now the reason I wanted this guy was to for the The air oxygen levels. But we've already done that puzzle, so why do we need this guy? On behalf of the court chocker board, I congratulate you on your speedy recovery and brand new lungs, liver, upper intestine, lower intestine, stomach and kidneys. You made a fantastic choice going with our premium Biofix range. Did you know that Biofix has been rated number one in Japan for six years running? We're even using them in the oxygen system in the mule dive suits. So there we go. You have to use Biofix. Due to the cost of these items, you have been upgraded to debt band one. You will be pleased to know that we could take our family's gross income as collateral. They have been transferred to Titan and given positions as hard labor specialists. Once your debt has been paid, they will be free to hand in their notice should they wish. I was raised at a salmon hatchery on Luna. According to my mother, I've wanted to be a marine biologist since I was five. I'm not the best swimmer, but I've gotten to know marine life intimately throughout books and laboratory research. My obsession with bloodthirsty manite has spurred me to seek a post at this facility, working with great minds like Dr. Kubilius is an added perk. Tidious, do you realise you lost 70% of your blood in the attack? Count your blessings dude, I hope to take this as a sign to stop your crazy solo out out outings. outings. What if you get hurt again? What if security finds out? I dragged your ass back to the mule this time, but I can't always be there for you. I know you're worried about your family, dude, but there are other ways to help them. Talk to me, we'll figure it out together. It's easy for her to tell me to stop. Her dad is rich, meanwhile my family is chipping away at rocks. 
Mr. Bassagand, the board has seen fit to approve your request for the specimen to be placed into your care. In light of your unique connection with the creature, however, we are aware of the unexploded spear gun shaft that, and request that you proceed with extreme caution. Management wants to know how this species survives at such depths, and you are to report your findings directly to Dr. Atlas Moon. Dr. Kubilius, Kubilius. I apologise if I interrupted you during a sensitive moment yesterday. I just wanted to tell you that I am a huge fan of your work. Your thesis on memory-coded RNA was an inspiration to me. Could you spare me a few moments of your time when you're feeling better? I'd love to show you the research I'm working on. Of course, that's nothing as revolutionary as yours. Still, there is something strange about the fauna down here. Something more than can be accounted for by the extreme conditions. Do you ever wonder what the Omega Boys are doing? Well, it is bio-warfare, or something like it. I retrieved a sample from the corpse on one of the Omega Lab products before it was cremated. Do you know about the microbe's behaviour towards genetic structure? I am forwarding a copy of my report of the partial genome. With the deepest admiration, Tidgis. Tidgis, I heard you are back at the aquarium. We should talk. Lalaya Van Wick. I've kept jaws on ice but it's still alive and I will keep it that way until I have extracted every ounce of sweet revenge. Come on, I know you read the messages, I know you at least see them. Well, I found it. The microbe is in the shark, pulling apart its genetic structure and moulding it back together like putty, just like it did with those Omega corpses. This species shouldn't even exist, but she is neither dead nor alive here. The microbe must be en endemic to this region. It appears to form a sim symbiotic relationship with the other organisms in the ecosystem. And everything is little infected. There's something else too, additional genomic information that PS139 brings with it. I can't quite understand it yet, but I'm getting close. I've been testing the PS139 extract on the deep sleepers in the adjacent lab, cut the microbe with the holy dust and a little MDMA. I even pulled them out of stasis for a few minutes to get as much info as possible. Moon's pet, product 6455A3, was particularly violent so I gave her a little extra juice and surprise critter cocktail. Yes, I'm breaking the law, but I'm all in now. I've ordered six more. Hopefully I'll get some adult products this time. Shit. The deep sleepers, that's the guys that we, we've turned one of them off. I want to turn them all off. From now on, I'm using holy dust only, no MDMA. It provides the perfect neural delivery agent. I'm writing to you on behalf of the board to hereby order a halt on any further excursions using Kane Corporation equipment or time. While the board appreciates your enthusiasm, it sees little value in your current research, therefore it does not deem the risk to Kane properly justified. I would also remind you that your family is several months behind in debt repayment. Speaking personally, I am shocked at your recklessness. Kane has graciously made you a better man in this smack of ingratitude. In pardon, I offer some advice. Next time you have a great idea, disregard it. Look at your duty list and go back to work. Not shared hallucination, hallucinations, memories, memories from previous PS139 hosts, all of them connected through a neural mycelium network. Imagine the entertainment value of this shit. Test subjects, I need more test subjects. Lester, you old salt dog, come join me for a little holy dust tonight after your shift ends. Keep it on the down low. I'm keeping up appearances, letting them think I'm crazy. I'm... In an insane world, a sane man must appear totally bonkers. I slipped a bit on my magic dust due to Korea while he was recovering in the med bay. He will be my control subject. After Lester survived my experiment, I decided to try the distilled PS139 RNA extract on myself. My personal microdosing is proven fruitful. The process induces a walking dream that can only be described as a shared neural network of images sounds of emotions, I have managed to limit the duration of the experience to a few seconds and damn, it was a ride. I swear I touched God. The world melted into a Van Gogh painting and I joined the metamorphosed reality of a million minds screaming together. Milford lasted an hour, he's not doing well. Jesus Christ, how long is this log? Request for financial compensation. A copy of my results is enclosed, included, enclosed as proof of concept. The findings are going to revolutionise the entertainment industry. Do you think I'm a fool? I know about the tumour. Tubalicious. I got it out of Milford. The coward told me you're the reason it hasn't been removed. Why would that be? 
I looked up to you. Maybe I'm a fool, but only for that. Congratulations. Due to the sensitive and unconventional nature of the research and your blatant disregard for procedure, it has been decided that a more experienced project land project project lead is needed to oversee the next phase of trials. We do not recognise private research. You will turn over all relevant data to Dr. Yamada's team upon their arrival. Dave Gallagher. And over my research, I've paid their price of my flesh and blood. Now they need to reciprocate. Reciprocate, starting with you, Gallagher. I'm releasing Holy Dust and Aerosolized PS139 into the vents so that everyone can see God. I've called up an old conduct topside. They're sending in a career in a week. Looking forward to sitting on a sunny beach collecting my 20%. You're all scientists. You must understand that suffering is essential to progress. I only recently grasped this, but now I'm free. Jesus wept. This guy was insane. You released that into the vents. What a dafty. What the hell? Fuck knows what that is. Some sort of amalgamation. Oh, there we go. Groats on the hands. Lovely. Looks like a hand fanny. You could fuck it. Taking masturbation to the next level. No messages. Ah, these are the people. That was him. The scientist. Right. A monster. A gargantuan eel like monstrosity lies suspended in water. That's the jellyfish we saw. Chamber of aquatic defilement where numerous fish have been subjected to torture and invasive procedures. Ah, shit. Shit. Seven five four one? Seven five four one? Maybe? Security system. Oh my god, we remembered it. Charlie Mac. Mac, look at this. Looks like a rover. Big one. That could be our way out of here. Where is this, Moses? I can show you. Transmitting target coordinates. Okay. Yeah, so that's not far on the seabed. Um, I can make it there. Seems like a big risk. Well, that's our reality right now. Yeah, right. Well, there we go. So we've got the pressure. We'll wait there. Let's enter that into the suit. Now it's done. Nine 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 pot. Five eight nine. Nine 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 five eight nine. Excellent. Do we have a coordinate? No, we still need the heating system. And the lungs are damaged or missing. Right, I know what to do. Give the lungs to the bear. Give me the bear. Let's go to the table. And the table was bio... Shit. It's not bio shit, bio, bio med. Bio something. We can repair them by doing that. Table? 
was in here. Yeah, there we go. Right, I don't know why we can't place this. Why we can't place that there? Ah, uh, maybe, I know why. Maybe we need to do this first. Right. Biofix. There's lungs. I'm not an expert, but boom! There we go. I do not like this, Charlie Mac. Everything is slimy. This is a dangerous place. I know, sweetheart. But I need those lungs. If you can repair them, can you try? I am brave syringe. and strong. Got a syringe. Hypodermic syringe. Insufficient processing power in medical suite. Non-responsive VAT. Yeah. Shit, have I messed it up because I turned this off? Oh, wait there. Wait, 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 wait. I'm shutting all these guys down. See if something happens. These suffer. It is painful. Right, the vat. Ah, this operation requires CSF. So now we've got enough power because we shut down all the vats. I get it. I get what we did there, even though I did that by complete fluke. We need spinal fluid. Okay, okay, okay. We can't change this. I thought we might be being able to get out of that. Where will we get spinal fluid? I think I know. This person is bent over in half. But I forgot where they are. This guy. Wait, hold on. Give me that. Spinal fluid, I'm a fucking beast. Hmm. Okay, that's... How do we... That looks like it's too cold.
spinal fluid. What about the shock? I want to try and see if we can dismantle this thing. Spear tip meets explosive harpoon. And we've got something for cutting and blowing stuff up. Two of my Brilliant. favorite pastimes. Okay. We've got something that cuts. I know what to try and use this on. Uh, with a bear. I need that. Right, we're there. Let's get back to the tunnels. I think we can get whatever's inside of this creature. Well, Cassia creature, human. What used to be human. This guy here. Yeah, babe. Spinal. Spine. All about the spine. Give me as a needle. That's it. Bob's your auntie. Excellent. Okay. Proceed. Fix these bad boys. That is hideous, isn't it? Actually fix the lungs. Sorry, bro. Now lungs. I, do, I still don't know what to do with this guy, though. Perfect. Now the heat. Don't put an explosive device in there. That's not going to work. Where's this guy? Ah. Can she combine this? I know it's a faulty igniter, but... Old thruster was useless on the dive suit, but... Yeah. Works just fine as an explosive timer. Waste not, want not, Charlie. So we've got an explosive timer now. Does that mean he can use this to open up this door? It's a... Uh... Guys, Boom, up. motherfucker. I'm about to blow this lock. Loud noises. Oh, yeah. Loud noises. Yeah. What the hell was that? I didn't see. What happened? It's like some kind of giant fucking insect. Language, Mac. It blew out of the escape pod. Ran right by me. Would you prefer it stuck around? Ooh, lads. We've, we've just unleashed aliens. Rain. You said they were alive. Well, I thought they were. Did that, uh, that thing burst out of her? Or feeding on her? Or. Someone there? Someone actually there? We're using active channels. They were using this body suit radio. That's what I heard. Someone there? Or more dreams? In the haze? Who is this? Are you part of the research team? Are you Kane? Black. Dark. Can 
can't see. We can't move. Explosions. Are you hurt? Are you okay? The haze. The pain. He's rambling. We should try and find him. Find him? What for? You remember the guy upstairs? All these other bodies? Who says he isn't the one running around doing it? And if he isn't? He could help us. Maybe he knows a way out of here. He's in the dark. I am here. And nowhere. Yeah. I don't think he's going to be much help. Nah. I think that this, this is not a human speaking. Well, it might be, just be like a brain in a in a tube being having its like brain waves synthesized through a voice box or some shit like that. Or it's just being like directly processed via computer to the radio stations. I don't think we've got but we've got a acetylene torch. Even if we don't find any juice for this, it still makes for an excellent eye gouging device. Yes it does. So I didn't mean to do that. Can we combine that? No. Let me check if there's anything else in this pod. No, that was it. It's the dead man. Hmm. We've done pretty much everything. Oh, did this door open? This is a new door, I'm pretty sure it is. But tell you what we'll do, let me save it. Done. We'll call an episode there, lads. When we come back, we'll go through this doorway. I'm pretty sure this is new. And we'll find out where to go. We need to find a heating element for the suit. And then we can get the suit operational. I think we've got all the other information around that. It's just that's the one last piece we need. Hope you've enjoyed the episode, lads. See you in the next one.